Hey everybody, RC here. Wanted to talk a little bit about edges and how to be able to use your brushes to be able to create cool edges. So let's take a look at this. I'll go ahead and I'll start with a regular brush. I want to be able to set up the document first. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to double click to unlock this and I'll just go ahead and I'll call this shoes. And now I'm going to command click a new layer here at the bottom and I'm going to fill this with white. So I'm going to do a command delete or a control backspace. So now we wind up having a white layer at the bottom and we have the shoes layer on the top. Now, normally when you wind up using a mask, you wind up just kind of painting in with a, with a soft brush or you try to find some sort of specific effect to be able to kind of cut the edges of this out. So let's go ahead and create a mask. We'll go ahead and click on this and we'll create a mask. And the brush that I have here is the plastic rash brush. Now, normally when people wind up doing stuff is they wind up just clicking on the very, very edges of this and kind of bringing this down. But what you wind up doing is you just wind up using the right side of that brush. And there's a lot of interesting going on on the left side of the brush. So why not invert your brush? Click on window and under window, go to your brushes and in your brushes, you'll notice that there's a directional that you can change here. So notice I have my brush here and if I wind up grabbing this and I point it upwards, it changes the orientation of the brush. If I point this over to the left, it changes the orientation of the brush. So the opposite ends of a brush can give you some really interesting effects if you just spend some time and playing with them. So now by switching this across and alternating these, you can actually wind up creating some really interesting effects.